What's up adventurers? I'm excited to bring this bag review to you today because it's a project made by a personal friend of ours and it's awesome. By looking at it, you can't really tell, but this is a switch bag. And I mean, not like light switches or what other kind of switches are there? <laughs> or fan switches, but Nintendo switches. This is a switch bag by ABXY. Oh, buttons from a controller. So this is made by our friends Mari and Peter. Mari is a gamer. I'm sure you've seen her if you're on YouTube, Atomic Mari. She spends a ton of time gaming. They both do. And they've been looking around for the perfect switch bag forever. I remember talking to them years ago and they were talking about designing a bag. And so it's so cool to see it finally made. They've really put a lot of thought into how you can use this and also making it stylish. If you know Mari, she's super stylish and cool. I always wish I could dress like her, but the guy version, nah, I would dress like her. Now I'm not a hardcore gamer by any means, but I do love playing Nintendo games, always have since I was a kid. So I was excited to finally get the Switch way too late. I've been traveling mostly with this guy. It doesn't really give me much space or use. I put the Switch in here and some games, but a lot of times I can't bring another controller for Esther to play or I have to pack it separately. I love this design. It's small, sleek, yet big enough to carry everything that you need. So the bag's capacity fits the dock, two switches, you know, cause you each have to have your own, or if you do each have your own, and two controllers, plus all the cables that you need and a bunch of games. Let's check out the details. This was modeled after a doctor's bag, which opening this, I can't even describe how satisfying this is, but as soon as we got it in the mail, I sent them a note because this motion is extremely satisfying. Inside, you can see that there is a foam divider that helps you put your switch dock as well as the switches that you want. You can throw your controllers in here. There's a couple mesh pockets for you to put anything you need to organize like your cables. Otherwise, it's pretty straightforward. A cool feature is there are two little holes right here on the side. And the purpose of this is you could actually play your switch right out of the bag. So if your switch is docked inside here, you can run your cables right out of these holes to your TV and keep playing. On the back, there's a zippered section that you could keep anything else you need. I would probably throw my phone in here, keys, etc. On the bottom, you have a section to keep all the games that you need. And by all, I mean 10. You can put the switch down here. Oh, this is where the second switch goes. So you have a switch down here while you have the switch up there and you can play it in theater mode. And in theater mode, you can mount it in here. As you can see, it'll rest on the ground. So pretend this is the ground and I can sit and play. Besides that, it's built with 600D polyester, keeping the water out, keeping your stuff dry and protected. And the final colors are actually gonna come in black and a white. This gray was a prototype that they weren't really happy with the colors with, but now I have an exclusive color. I imagine myself in high school when I wanted to play games and just being able to bring my system over to my friend's house and having this is so much cooler. So that's it. It's nice and straightforward. If you have a Switch, you should definitely check this out. We're gonna link to the Kickstarter below so you can get exclusive pricing. They're gonna be planning on releasing them by September. So be sure to get your order in. Congrats, Abski. So guys, be sure to check this out. Let me know in the comments below what you think. If you play the Switch, what is your favorite game? I need a new game to play. Thanks and I'll see you guys later.